I am Top Orlando Realtor Scott Garrison with Remax Town and Country. We're at 1630 Dally. That's D A L Y, Orlando, Florida, 32808, here in Robinswood. If you're looking for a really good deal, something that needs a little bit of work, this is your home. And the purpose of this video is to give you a better view than the pictures that you see online on Realtor.com, Zillow, Trulia. How do I know that? Because if you saw those pictures, I'm the one who took both of those, for sure. So I get a lot of calls from investors, people wanting to buy this, saying what's the neighborhood like? There's only one way to know, and that's to walk up down the street a little bit, here about 3.30 in the afternoon on a weekday. People love this area of pine hills for sure the houses are less than or probably 75 percent of the value of anywhere else in orlando very rentable good neighborhood for that average home in orlando right now is two hundred and seventy five thousand dollars and this home, in its current condition, is $135,000, which is dramatically less than the average home. So fix it up, get a lot of equity, and that's why people come out here. We're at the intersection of Bolling, B-O-L-L-I-N-G, and Dally. And you've got owner-occupants, you've got renters. really nice place for your next rental property one of the things that people like is low taxes for sure and no HOA a lot of people looking to buy a home to rent or looking for an affordable home don't want that HOA fee taxes here without homestead are only seventeen hundred and twenty nine dollars that's a year of course is really really low this particular house we're walking up on here three bedrooms two baths 1344 square feet with a heated living area and the slab including the garage and the back porch 1564 total this houses were all built in the 50s 1958 for this particular street in this particular house people call me all the time and say if you see a really good deal on something I want you to call me this is a really good deal so we're going to show you the good the bad the ugly you need to do fortunately you have to buy this all cash as a realtor they're all funny calls i get all these calls from people saying well what does all cash mean um and then I say, um, that means all cash in the bank. Cannot finance this due to the condition, the things that it needs. Most houses that need substantial repairs and that are really good deal would not be financeable. You can tell just from the outside, this one is not financeable. So remember, the point of this is to give you a feel. People also call and say, well, how bad is it? It's actually not that bad. But it does need some stuff, so this will help you kind of calculate how bad it is. We've got some substantially overgrown, for now, trees, bushes here, could be cut back for sure. Along the side, obviously concrete block on stucco, because there's the blocks. That will probably need to be fixed one day. We'll go into the backyard in just a minute. It's very typical of the homes in the neighborhood here for sure. You don't have to worry about keeping up with your yard. You've got to keep it cut. None of your neighbors are keeping up the yard much either. All right, see, look at that roof. I'm not a roofer. Substantial curling of the shingles. Definitely going to need a new roof. 
Might be able to get a couple years out of it if you buy it and rent it. But you're replacing the roof sometime soon. That's why the house is so cheap. We walk in and say, welcome home. We're going to go straight to the back, however. See our exterior tour next. So here we are on the very large once screen porch. No longer screened. There are a flock of robins coming through here in January. Seemingly a little early. You can hear them in the background. From what I understand, the AC hasn't been working in a while. That's why there's unit ACs out there. And chances are, just looking at the house, the AC wouldn't be working anyway. So this is going to be, depending on what you want to do with it, if you want to fix it up extra, extra nice, sell it to a retail owner-occupant, and you'd want to do a full rehab, if you want to buy it, fix up the things that need it, definitely rent it, almost in its current condition. Some paint, you can see the roof here probably. AC, all those things, which you probably end up doing on almost anything that you bought. It's been a while since somebody's been back here. We are uh, in January here. I think it's been November since anyone's lived here. You can see it's kind of thing you only get by coming out and looking yourself. All right, let's go inside. Got a kitchen. Need re renovating if you're going to flip it. Not need renovating. If you're going to rent it out, take that out. Put a window in there. Probably end up getting new appliances anyway. Although these are definitely working. It's really a nice floor plan. A nice big eat-in kitchen area or living room here formal dining room another living room and a one car garage which is unusual a little bit of leaking through that's part of why we might need a new roof very easy to fix garage door just a year or two old then we've got the utility room here Electrical panel has been updated for sure. And the hot water heater, who knows if that works or not. Electric and the water is on right now. And here we are at the entrance. Big living area again. Any rehab always looks like a disaster at front, but it all needs the same things. Draw raw repair, paint, some fixtures, fans, AC roof. Good cleaning, lots of stuff hauled away. Look at this dining room though. Maybe a couple of windows. Those have definitely seen better days. And all things that you would expect. This may be working, may be fixable. Doesn't look too bad in here. Only one way to find out. Let you buy it, see what you can do with it. Nice floor here. It's been replaced sometime. Hello. Probably wouldn't hurt to get replaced again. Here we 
original shower tile. You can't just go buy shower tile in pink anymore. The pan itself and everything seems solid. Bedroom number two of three. Nice size again. Of course, it's going to need paint and flooring. This is one of these ones again that looks bad. Paint, flooring, fan, all the stuff you'd expect anyway. Closet doors. Place would be looking good. And bedroom three of three. Commercial grade stick on tile that you could carpet right over. It looks like they did. You can see under the bed at one time anyway. Buy a house. Get some free furniture. And the main bath. In ceramic tile that would probably clean up good. Uh, that's probably getting replaced. Can't just go buy yellow tile somewhere. Kind of nice, so retro. It's now modern. It may or may not be fixable. With the drawer there. So if you're looking for the inside scoop on a rehab property, something to make a great rental or a great deal out here in the Pine Hills area, you should call me, Top Orlando Realtor, Scott Garrison with Remax Town & Country. Been doing this 32 years, full time, every day, every day. Let me help you too.